had to see this, self-driving cars hit the road yesterday <laughs> in California, you're from there, so, they're, but there are already problems. Yeah, man, look, two driverless cars, both with people along for the ride, just barely avoided colliding into one another. CNET senior editor Jeff Bacalar is here with us now. What the heck happened? Yeah, this was a near miss, is what <laughs> yeah. we're going to officially call it. <laughs> two self-driving cars, a Google car cut off another car, and, uh, you know, at least no one was able to flip each other off, right? Because it was just <laughs> self-driving cars. No, but, uh, yeah, it, but there was no collision, right? So the story is that everyone's fine. And look at that little tiny car. I mean, something like this. I'm also curious, like, as more and more technology companies yeah. produce these types of cars or actually have prototypes of them, you know how, like, Microsoft stuff is incompatible with Apple stuff? Right. So if you have a Google car and you've got a Tesla car, I mean, there <laughs> could be just, some issues. Yeah, they'll just instantly collide and want to destroy <laughs> right. each other. No, um, it's, what's crazy is that, you know, they just were allowed to sort of go 25 miles an hour outside of their general campus. There was a there was a time where they were only regulated to like a certain sort of runway. And now that they're sort of quote unquote out in the wild, we're starting to hear that you know, for the most part, they're they're operating normally. Mm. This isn't really a widespread sort of issue just yet. Any of the accidents, is, well, this goes for Google cars. Any of the accidents those cars have been involved in were uh, uh, fender benders where the car, the automated car was hit from behind. So it's not like they're running into other cars. People, humans, are running into the robots. I don't know if I want to buy a, a driverless car on an almost and a, you know, right. nearly theory. <laughs> totally, and I'm with you. It's <laughs> not, we're not there yet, but we're really close. And you think? Definitely. How close? I think five to ten years. Okay, so Elon Musk said he yeah. thinks that driving will be illegal. Does he By know this is America? Yeah. Then, well, yeah. You'd have to yeah, rewrite exactly. every single Bruce Springsteen song ever written to happen. say, just, like, the be computer took, the me, yeah. took yeah. me to marry. <laughs> they, won't, they won't be able to identify. <laughs> but here's the deal. It, the second a robot is more efficient and safer than a human, as soon as they're, the, this is going to sound a little dark, but the second robots kill less people than humans kill people, then that will be okay and we'll be all right with it. It's just, you just got to go by what's the safer sort of alternative and the second a fleet of robot driving trucks controlled by kill less people than humans do then we're gonna go with come that. back to me with those numbers i'm just saying it's not here yet but it's definitely Man, gonna happen it'll happen